Hi Capricorn, welcome to your mid-June 2022 general reading. We're going to see what comes out for you, what spirit wants you to know, what's coming towards you for mid-June to the end of June. You always know that it can go on longer. There is no timing when it comes to the universe. Everything happens in divine timing and perfect timing. And this is for Capricorn. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. The link to my Etsy shop is down below for personal readings. This already popped right out. Butterfly Spirit. Transformation is beautiful. Card of Eleven. Um, the, Etsy, the link to my Etsy shop is down below. There is a summer sale going on on Etsy. It's from now until July 2nd. So half of my readings are 20% off. Okay, record. Thank you, Spirit. All right, two came out. And at the bottom is royal, the royal you. So I feel like a major transformation is going on within you. Loving yourself. Forgiving yourself. Oh, wow, three came out. The roses kiss. And look at all that glowing gold light. That ladybug, good fortune coming to you. Great big love. It could be in terms of love, true love, romance, and also awakening genius. All right, we're going to see. For Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus Spirit. For Capricorn. No, I was just told to shuffle again. Always take what resonates with you and leave what doesn't. And then also watch your rising moon and Venus sign. Readings. <clears throat> For additional clarity and to get a bigger picture on what's coming towards you. Thank you, Spirit. Seven of Cups. Choices. Decisions to make. Page of Cups. Young water, younger water sign could be around you. Pisces, um, Cancer, Scorpio. But with the Seven of Cups, you have choices to make. You might be getting a few offers. Page of Cups can be like a friendly offer, um, invitation to go somewhere. some hurt here. There could be a younger water sign that's coming in to give you an apology. They could have air and water in their chart, but there's some pain that they caused you. I feel like you've, you might be a little bit closed off to the offer. You might not want to make a decision. What else is happening for my Capricorns? Sun, Moon, and Rising, Venus, Spirit. Sun, Moon, and Rising, and Venus. Okay. There's going to need to be a decision made around a connection. The Lovers is in the center of the reading. I feel like awakening genius could be somebody awakening to the connection that they have with you. Had or have. 
but I feel like they're going to need to come in with an apology, with an explanation. You might have air in your chart. I feel like you're, you know, with this transformation going on, I feel like you've been, become mentally grounded. And it's, I don't know if you're feeling this off, but we'll see what comes out. The Ace of Cups. This person definitely wants to come in and give you another offer. Love, passion, a brand new beginning with you. Better times ahead and wish fulfillment. They see the future with you. Anything else from the Capricorn Spirit? They're ready to fight for this. Emperor, um, masculine or feminine, it's like they, ha they have eyes for you. They want, um, they see everything with you. They see you very abundant, very, you know, beautiful, handsome. You take care of yourself. You're happy within your life. You make your own happiness. Also a card of fertility, but it's like they want to come in and fight for this connection. They now know it's a deeper, it's a deep connection, a soulmate connection, one that they cannot stop thinking about. What else for my Capricorn spirit? What else for my Capricorns? Thank you. Yeah, I feel like by I feel like from the end of the month from now till the end of the month, you're holding out a little bit. Maybe playing hard to get. Depends on what this pain is that they caused you. It's gonna be different for all of you. But like I said, they could be a younger water sign or have water in their chart. The lovers is Gemini, so they could have they could be an air sign also. I feel like they they want to fight for you. They want to apologize to you. They want to ask you to have a brand new beginning with them. But the four of coins, though, I feel like you're going to hold out. I don't know if in the future. But from now till the end of the month, I don't see you making a big decision. Please clarify. Thank you, Spirit. The Seven of Cups, the Four of Stars. Yeah, you have this person you could have lived with. You could have been married to and separated from with the Four of Wands. 11, 11, 11. 11 three times here. But I feel like with awakening the genius and big love, I feel like your fortune is them realizing the connection. But through this separation, there's been a transformation within yourself. There's been a grounding, mentally grounded, and you showing up at the Empress, I, I feel like you've done a lot of work on yourself. Like I said, you made your own happiness. Why is the Page of Cups here? Please clarify the page of cups for Capricorn Spirit. The Nine of Hearts. I don't feel like they were ready for this connection. I don't feel like they thought they were going to fall in love. Why is the Three of Swords here? Please clarify the Three of Swords. Thank you, Spirit. The two of angels, yeah. You're still, I, for some of you, you may still be a little hurt. Closed off. They might have came in and romanced you. And as quickly as it fizzled, I mean, as quickly as they rushed in, romanced you, had you feeling a certain type of way for them, I feel like then they, they exit it very quickly. Left you broken hearted, left you confused. Why is the King of Swords here? 
Thank you, Spirit. The Six of Stars. Yeah, you became mentally grounded in this. It's like now you're the one shining. and It's like they can't, they see you shining. You made your own victory for yourself. You took this experience and made it like a Wheel of Fortune moment. Turned everything into your favor. But I still, with the lovers in the center, I still feel like you feel this connection also. The Ace of Stars, yeah. You both have passion for one another. And please clarify the Ace of Cups for Capricorn. All right, so Capricorn, they could also have Earth in their chart. Water, but really water, air, Earth, it doesn't matter, the, the sign. It's, they're coming in grounded. They want to offer you communication. They want to offer you the truth. They want to offer you a confession. With the Ace of um, Swords. And why is the Seven of Wands here, Spirit? Thank you. The Moon. I feel like they're going to fight for this. They're, they want to tell you their secrets. They want to tell you what's been going on with them. The things that they hid from you before. I don't think it's anything like destructive, like cheating or some lying or addiction. Nothing like that. It's, I don't think they really meant, I don't think they knew that they were going to fall in love with you. I don't think they expected it. And the Empress and the Four of Queens. The High Priestess. Yeah, you're going to be silent for a little bit. I feel like you're going to continue to work on yourself. Get grounded. Continue to make your own happiness with the High Priestess. You're going to remain a little silent. A little, uh, you know, I feel like it was a spiritual awakening and transformation for you during the separation. I feel like you thought they moved on, but all along, they, they with the lovers in the middle, they never could shake the connection. You're going to go with your intuition though on this. And with them coming in as the king of trees and offering you their cup of love, Feel like you're going to be able to trust it they've done some work they can offer you more than what a page could have offered you they just might not have been in the right energy and they've also done some transforming so you're going to have to go with the connection the communication when it comes in spirit advice advice for capricorn sun moon rising in Venus. From mid June to end of June. Thank you. Anything else? No place like home. And the Four of Wands, the 1111 card came out. For some of you, I think you felt like this person was home to you. Like I said, you could have been living together, you could have been engaged, you could have been that higher level of commitment. Mending, see? And go the distance, wanted to pop out. All right, Spirit. Final messages for Capricorn. What is coming towards them from mid June to end of June 2022? Anything else? I, psychic ability, trust your intuition. That's the high priestess in you. You could have very, you could have uh, air in your chart. You have empress here. You could have a strong air position. Parrot, someone will gossip about all your secrets. So with that, don't always, you know, always keep some, with the four of coins, keep something for yourself. 
Keep your feelings to your chest. Don't trust everybody with all your feelings. You know, like a coworker. You go to work and you just spill your, you know, to everybody around you. They're, of course, they're the people you probably see the most in your life, the people that you work with. But not everybody has your best interests at heart. Chair empty. Someone leaving your life. Maybe it's the person that you find gossiping about you. Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus Spirit. All right. Tower, solid foundation, success with effort. I have to show you another card of success. You've gotten success three times ladder, climbing towards success. I feel like, like I said, with the ladybug here, there's good fortune coming your way. I feel like you're not going to expect it. Something of a blessing is coming towards you, unicorn. Use your intuition to make beneficial changes. That's use your intuition twice. Bouquet, compliments from an admirer. See, Capricorn, this person just might show up at your doorstep, show up at your work, and have flowers in their hand. And say, you know, you were losing you was my biggest regret. A lot of that is happening within these signs. With this strawberry moon, a lot of love and romance is happening. A lot of um, connections And box, you will receive a gift. See, yet yeah, there is something huge coming for you from now till the end of June. Leave me a message. Let me know how this resonates. And like I said, always take what resonates and then always go to your rising, your moon, and your Venus sign for additional um, messages and clarity. All right, Capricorn, I will be back for many more readings. I'm going to do a weekend reading. Um, and then I don't know what I'll do from there. Maybe start the beginning of July or messages from spirit. But have a great weekend and I will talk to you soon. Stay safe.